So, hi everyone, and welcome back to my channel. For today's video, I'm doing my park life vlog, my annual park life vlog. I mean, I've only been two years, but um, still. Um, so yeah, I mean, I tried the best I could, but I was legal to drink this year. I did take it a little bit too far, so you know, you be the judge of how well I did. Um, but yeah, I had a great time. You can see the events unfold, and I will keep popping in to update you on what's happening but yeah subscribe if you haven't already right. so guys we're in Nan why are my lips so small mm. are you doing a little vlog mm, a little for the mems is this the prt vlog i oh, know not pretty little thing what's <laughs> what are you talking about you're doing a youtube video for oh, like, no no this isn't the oh poly video yeah, though, but i'd have been filming for oh poly well, you're doing a youtube video aren't you? yes but this is for part life so god you hurt my head anyways I think you are the thickest. Stuff. <laughs> uh, I'll talk to you later because. Uh... <laughs> <laughs> Not the sun bed. So we've just, we've just been for a Nando's. And now, I don't really know what we're doing. We've got 21 Savage. So it's the morning of Saturday, the 11th of June, part life day. Last night we literally just went for a Nando's. I'm talking. You can talk. What are you doing? Filming for my YouTube. Oh, I'm not featuring this yet. You have? No, you haven't. You were just laughing at me. I need to watch it, actually. Yeah, uh, we went to Nando's last... God, I look rough. We went to Nando's last night, and now... Um, I'm going to have a glass of wine at ten past ten in the morning, because that's how I roll. Fancy glass, though. Yeah, we're going to get ready and then go to Mia's. Mia said we're getting a minibus, by the way. Oh, sorry. So we're about don't watch watch my wine. About to go to part life. Part life form. Show your outfit. Where's it from? Urban Outfitters. Alexander Wang. Some random sleeves. Where's your outfit from? Um, Rivera Boutique. Doc Martens. Tips <laughs> Bella. <laughs> this is StockX. That's oh, I'll show you my pants. I don't know where that. Oh, Bershka. Yeah, we've got a mini bus, and then we're about to go. Okay, Um, I was far too hungover to film day two morning because I didn't sleep because I was hungover. That's why you don't drink wine at 10am. 
No, I do that again. That was me. Um, day one was good. Security was just... Uh, you could sneak anything into that festival, like literally anything. I could have brought a fucking alligator and they wouldn't have even noticed. Do you know what I mean? Um, but yeah, it was good. Day one was good. Probably my favourite day. But yeah, this goes straight into day two. So. <laughs> I mean, I didn't exactly finish it because I had to be picked up early by my mum because I had a sociology A-level the next morning. So, yeah, she came all the way up to Manchester to pick me up at, like, quarter past nine. So I did miss bicep. But I'm going to see them at Creamfields anyway, so it's all OK. Um, yeah, I had a really good time. The only problem is I felt that it was very, very overcrowded, more than it was last year, and getting home was a massive problem um it was really really bad i think they need to sort of sort like solid ways to get home or even potentially turn it into a camping festival because there are no solid ways to get home because everyone sort of leaves at one time you know taxes it's just all a bit of a mess so i think i'm not too sure what they could put in place um but yeah because getting home is quite difficult for me Obviously, I stayed at my friend's house, Rio's house in Manchester. But last year, I stayed in a hotel in central Manchester and I had to walk from Heaton Park to Manchester, which was ridiculous. Luckily, we didn't have to do that this year because it was only one night that I had to make it home because the second night my mum came and got me, which was all OK. But yeah, I do recommend going. Um, they were very strict on ID this year, though, when buying drinks, very, very strict on that. I got my ID checked around four times per drink that I bought. Um, so someone would be like, can I see your ID? And then their manager would be like, can I see your ID? And I'm like, Jesus Christ, yes. Um, but yeah, I had a good time. Um, if you went, comment down below and tell me who your favourite act was. And I'll see you in my next video. Bye.